Hello, my beautiful sisters. I hope you're doing well. Protein has a major role when it comes to your beauty. Basically, how tight, how firm your body will stay. How tight, firm and glowing your skin is going to stay. How well your body is going to produce collagen. All of that depends largely on your protein intake. Protein is not something that you can develop by yourself. You have to take it externally. And protein is something that you have to refill every day in your body. The quality of protein that you're taking, the quantity of protein that you're taking, and a special concept called protein cycling. That means how and when you take your protein. This largely impacts the amount of collagen that is going to be created in your body. And today I'm going to tell you about protein cycling, a technique which supports in maximum collagen production in your body, which is going to enhance tightness, firmness in your skin and overall you looking very young. Yes, my girls, how you look, literally how old or how young you look is also impacted by your protein intake. So today you are going to be very clear about this concept and you will also know what to do. Don't worry, there is no time like best time or worst time. If you start today, you will definitely be able to see very good changes in your body and in your skin. Protein cycling is something that I came to know very recently actually. And I started following it immediately. It actually completely changed the way I think about food and skin health. What is fascinating is that I saw more changes. See, I'm somebody who follows a very clean diet and I do things like fasting and good protein intake, organic food, a lot of fruits and vegetables. All of these things are very normal for me. But when I started protein cycling, I saw more changes in the firmness of my skin. I am more fascinated by how protein cycling can actually make more difference to your collagen production. So let's begin quickly. But before that, a mandatory introduction for my girlies watching me for the first time. My name is Shilpa Raidas. I am 37 years. I live in Pune and I love beauty and I love anti-aging. And this channel is all about that. We have videos on skincare, anti-aging, diet, nutrition and personality glow up, which is all around beauty. See, I believe that beauty is a holistic approach and one can become the most beautiful version of themselves anytime they decide with the right technique. And it is possible for one to look 10 years, 15 years younger than they age. We can completely reverse our biological age. But for that, we need to follow a holistic approach to beauty. And if you also want the same, to look like the most beautiful version of yourself and to look 10 years, 15 years younger than your age, then this channel is for you, my girl and you should subscribe right away. So what is the collagen and protein connection firstly? Collagen is a structural protein that gives our skin its firmness and its tightness. Collagen has got a lot of functionalities. It is a part of too many processes in our body, but we are just gonna talk about specifically skin right now. It is what gives our skin that lifted look. So our skin needs a certain form of collagen, but the collagen is not found in foods in the same form. Your body has to make it. So basically, we take the foods which help in collagen synthesis. Once you eat that food, our body synthesizes and creates collagen with the help of that food. And to do this, our body needs the right amino acids. That comes from our dietary protein. So without the amino acids, Without the protein intake, collagen synthesis, that is the creation of collagen in your body, is not going to happen. So, if you do not take adequate protein, your body is not going to get the amino acids that it is needed to produce, synthesize more collagen. Are you getting me? Now, what are the three key amino acids that our body needs from the protein that we eat to create more collagen? Glycine, proline, and hydroxyproline. So when you eat protein-rich foods like paneer, tofu, chicken, lentils, eggs, fish, your body breaks them down into amino acids and uses them as building blocks to create more collagen. Now here comes the twist and the protein cycling we are going to talk about.
So our body is as such, my girls, that when we are habituated to a certain lifestyle, to certain timings, certain food habits, then our body gets adapted and doesn't perform at its best. That is why for maximum performance, people change their training styles time and again. People change timings for intermittent fasting. Because when our body is adapted and habituated to certain behaviors and certain timings, it does not prioritize maximum performance. It goes in a much relaxed, relaxed state. And when something new happens in our body, then it starts performing at its best. That is why even in intermittent fasting, there is this concept that you trick your body. You don't, you know, you don't uh, do intermittent fasting at all times, at all days for the same hours. You trick your body up and down. Then only your body is going to perform maximum benefits of fasting. So even protein intake is the same thing. If your protein intake is constant and predictable every single day, your body is going to adapt and it will stop prioritizing collagen synthesis, not to the maximum extent, but to some extent. And this is when it will start using the protein mostly for energy and muscle repair. And that is where protein cycling comes into play. So what is protein cycling? Protein cycling simply means alternating between high and medium and low protein intake on different days so that your body stays metabolically flexible. It will keep your collagen producing enzymes alert and signals your body to keep creating new collagen instead of slowing down. Think of it like a workout. So I just gave you the example of workout. People keep training their workout regimes so that the body stays, uh, you know, flexible, doesn't get adapted, right? That's the same thing that we're doing with protein intake. On higher protein days, your body will get a surge of amino acids, which is going to be perfect for collagen synthesis and also tissue repair. On lower protein days, your body is going to be more efficient in recycling the amino acids it already has. This balance is going to support anti-aging and longevity. So now that you know what is protein collagen connection and what is protein cycling, let us understand how to do protein cycling perfectly for your skin. Let's divide the days. Day one to day three, you are going to take high protein intake. You can aim for around 1.2 to 1.5 grams of protein per kg of your weight focus on complete protein on those days and less carbs like eggs lentils tofu paneer chicken uh, the list is endless okay there are a lot of protein rich foods choose for what you like what is available resourceful around you your taste and take it if you cannot replenish it completely with food then do opt for protein powders as well and with that add vitamin c rich foods in your diet oranges bell peppers avla citrus fruits because vitamin C activates your collagen synthesis. Also, please do not miss on adding copper, zinc and silica sources. Nuts, seeds, dark chocolates. Just Google it because these are minerals that support collagen synthesis. So we need amino acids from the protein. We need vitamin C rich foods and we need zinc, silica uh, rich foods because all of them are important to create good levels of collagen in your body. Now, on day four, now one, two, three, you took high protein intake. On day four, you will go moderate. You can go between 0 0.8 to 1 grams of protein uh, per kg weight. On those days, you can focus more on your veggies. And for protein, you can go for curd, your lentils, your sprouts. It also gives your digestive system a little break while supplying sufficient amino acids. And on day five, you are going to go low protein probably around 0 0.5 grams of protein per kg of your weight. Focus on hydration, focus on antioxidants, more on green plant foods. This will allow your body to recycle old collagen and also clear your damaged tissues. So then you are going to repeat this cycle. This way your skin is going to stay in constant repair and renewal rhythm. My girls, I'm trying my level best to explain to you in a very clear way. However, if there is any confusion in between, then do not miss to put it down in the comments and I will answer you, okay? And uh, on that note, uh, let me just remind you, if you haven't subscribed to the channel as yet, then that is so weird. Uh, subscribe to the channel and do not forget to click on the bell notification so that you get a notification every time a new video is up. Something which is equally important 
Let me tell you about a few support nutrients that support in collagen production. Even if you eat sufficient amount of protein every single day, your body will not be able to synthesize collagen if the supporting cofactors are not there. Here are a few which you should remember. First of all will be vitamin C. Vitamin C in our body triggers collagen cross-linking which is essential for its structure. Collagen synthesis, collagen cross-linking, vitamin C has a major freaking role. Copper. It is found in cocoa, nuts, seeds and it activates collagen enzymes. Zinc. Pumpkin seeds, paneer, eggs. It is essential for tissue repair. Silica. Found in cucumber, oats, leafy greens. It is going to strengthen your connective tissues. And glycine rich foods bone broth, gelatin, and soaked chia seeds. So you don't have to worry that some or the other nutrient you will get only from one food. You will get the list on the internet. Silica rich foods, zinc rich foods, vitamin C rich foods. Pick out what is tasty to you, what is resourceful to you, I mean uh, which is available to you, right? Which you can procure uh, not just for once or twice but always. You have to plan your diet, you have to plan your beauty it doesn't just come you know by fluke okay you have to deliberately decide intentionally that i am going to eat so and so i'm going to eat this daily because this has silica this has zinc this has copper this has vitamin c you have to decide on those foods this is protein for me i'm going to take this regularly i'm going to take this many grams and you have to make a culminative diet plan and follow that I tell you in all the freaking videos and I'm going to tell you in this one too without being regular with your food without being regular with your chosen uh, you know quantity and chosen resourceful food for a certain purpose which means you have to take it every single day it is not going to work you cannot expect to have two uh, oranges uh, you know twice a week and expect you will have radical changes on your skin you have to select those foods and deliberately have them every single day. You're taking kiwis, take them every single day. You're taking pomegranate, take them every single day. I have got so many videos on this channel which talk about collagen rich foods, fruits that are great for your skin, fruits that remove dark spots, pigmentation. Because I completely believe that food can change your life, your health, your beauty, everything my girls. And this is something which uh, is going to make us so self-sufficient because we our body will be capable of making itself clear making itself young and making itself more beautiful okay and please take my word for it when somebody takes good amount of protein you can see that youth on their face itself they're not going to be like forcefully young looking they're going to be like young young looking so these nutrient cofactors you have to add them to your diet along with high protein and that is only when your body is going to be able to create great amounts of collagen, my girls. So this is also a very, very important part. Start with your collagen producing journey right away. And trust me, I believe completely that it is never too late. I started my anti-aging journey. My anti-aging knowledge was zero till my early 30s. I was a person who never used to even wear a moisturizer or a sunscreen. I used to just wear makeup, come back, sometimes remove them or even not, have sugar the whole day, worse diet, worse sleeping routines, only parties and my lifestyle was not in the best benefits for my skin, for my beauty, longevity, good health and everything. But my interest grew in all these things in my early 30s where I wanted to really change my looks and I'm so grateful that I learned the right things like fasting and good diet and, you know, this food does this and all of the things I talk about on my channel, skincare, okay. And I started all of it in my early 30s and I'm 37 right now. And so many things changed for me within a few years. Some things started changing in a few months. Some things started changing in a year or two. Some things started showing more change in more years to come. And I believe that I look much younger than when I was, uh, you know, in my 27. I believe that I look much more attractive, brighter, younger, better now in 37. 
and all of this was intentional and planned i mean you have to make your heart and your mind strong your routines have to be good uh, your diet your nutrition has to be in place and you have to take care of your skin a certain way you have to recognize personally how is your skin type what kind of weather you guys are living in what are your stress levels what are your hormonal levels don't be stressed out by me telling all these things in a list because i am supposed to share with you i am sharing you my knowledge but it's not supposed to overwhelm you okay you don't have to do everything in one uh, overnight you just need to plan it out and one by one do it i did not start off with everything even to start things like fasting i took so much time in the beginning because i used to stop my heart and my mind and i had to fight all my urges and i had to fight my laziness to do skin care and and so many things my girls i'm just trying to say that it is not going to be easy but it is not going to be so freaking difficult as well when you decide one by one do it but do it make a list of everything you are learning simultaneously like today you learned about this so me keep it in your mind that you are going to start this and you're going to regulate this in your life and today to forever onwards carry this journey carry this beauty uh, habits and journey with you okay because not we are not doing this to look only beautiful today and to look young today we are doing this for our health for our beauty for our longevity forever and we are learning all these things so that not only our life but our family's life our friends lives are going to get better uh, together uh, with your body your beauty your whole community can get better and it is in your hands okay i wish you all the freaking best because i know you can do it at any time you start you are going to see changes my girls so be very sure of it and more than your uh, learning your discipline and your consistency is important and more than your discipline and your consistency your positivity is freaking important till you don't believe in something completely from your heart and your soul that you are doing something it is going to bring a change it is going to change your freaking life you are not going to see the change because things don't work out only manually physically practically things work out in vibrations and frequencies as well so if you just do things like i'm going to test this let's see is going to happen or not it is going to test you back it is not going to happen when you do something have that blind faith that it is going to work out for you and trust me girls this belief and this positivity and this faith is only what is going to change your life and your beauty i tell myself every single day that i'm the most beautiful girl in the world and i i am so beautiful and cute and young and everything and i don't feel weird when i say these things i'm not feeling weird when i'm sharing it with you also why should i feel weird because i'm not in a competition with anyone i'm doing this because i love myself and i love my beauty for myself and you have to feel the same way we are not doing this in competition with anyone in comparison with anyone we are not doing this to show anyone anything we are doing this because we just love ourselves and we love our beauty and we love the the person we would see in the mirror when we the fruits of all our hard work comes into play and nothing can be more better a more better feeling than this my girls okay so tell yourself proudly every single day when you pray in the morning in the evening that you are the most beautiful girl in the world you are the most beautiful woman in the world when you see your mirror see your positivity see your beauty see your spark don't see uh, the flaws that you call flaws right now don't see that see improvement okay your eyes and your mentality your mental state that connection is going to change your reality my girls trust me and on this positive note if you haven't subscribed to the channel still then that is so freaking crazy let's not do that subscribe to the channel right away and click on the bell notification so that you get a notification every time a new video is up we also have a whatsapp channel my girls there is a link in the description that will take you to our whatsapp channel join our whatsapp channel i send you 
tips and tricks about beauty, things related to beauty there. You will learn from it every day regularly. And if you want to be more connected to me, which I urge you to be, then this is my Instagram handle. There is a link in the description that will take you to my Instagram account. Go and follow me there. And uh, apart from all the knowledgeable things, you'll get to see my weird side there because I, I just do crazy stuff sometimes there. Okay. Thank you so much for your time, my girls. I can't wait to see you in the next video. I love you. Take care of yourself. Okay. Mwah. Love you. Bye.